A trip to a winery on the east end of New York's Long Island ended with a terrible tragedy this weekend when police say a drunk driver slammed into a limo carrying a bride-to-be and others. Meg Oliver has more. The crash scene on eastern Long Island shows the stretch limo crushed, a passenger door ripped off the car. Four young women inside were killed. Suffolk County Assistant District Attorney Elizabeth Miller. There was a bride, she survived, and a group of friends. It was a group of women celebrating an upcoming wedding. It happened Saturday evening. The driver and seven women were returning from a vineyard in the wine country. Police say as the limo attempted a U-turn, a red pickup barreled into its side. Police say three of the women died on impact. Two others were hospitalized with serious injuries. The victims from New York include 23-year-old Brittany Shulman of Smithtown, 23-year-old Amy Grabina from Comac, 23-year-old Stephanie Belly from Kings Park, and 24-year-old Lauren Baruch from Smithtown. The driver of the pickup, 55-year-old Steve Romeo, was arrested for drunk driving. He was arraigned Sunday on a million dollars bond. His lawyer, Daniel O'Brien. It's a tragic event. Okay. Condolences to all the families that are involved. The driver of the limousine, 58-year-old Carlos Pino, was also hospitalized. He will not face charges. The limousine company released this statement. This was a tragic accident on what should have been a happy day for a group of young women. We pray for the victims and for the families as they go through this unimaginable time. The crash was so violent it nearly cut the limo in half. The district attorney told me he's looking to upgrade those charges against the truck driver. Jeff. Meg, thank you.